Hey guys, this is Rachel. Thanks for stopping by to check out this video and our channel. Now, I was hoping that one of the girls would uh, do this video with me, but one has like sinus junk and the other one is, I don't know what she's doing. She's just not there physically. I think she's upstairs in a room, like cleaning a room or putting clothes away or something. I don't know. Anyway. So I wanted to show you a new box that I just signed up for and I just now got it because the, I want to say the October box was sold out. And so this is the November one and I've seen some reviews or, you know, some unboxing videos for this and it looked really good. Um, not sure it's worth the price though. I don't know tell me let me know what you think after after I get done unboxing everything um but I did order the authentic books and I know that there's like two or three different sizes so I might go with the smaller size um but I wanted to do like the what is it the most preferred option or whatever which is I want to say the medium size one could be wrong but it was like sixty dollars <laughs> Yeah, 60, so anyways, they send you an email and then you pick out your, there's like a, is it three different ones? Yeah, I think there's three different books that you can choose from that you can um, look at for your next month. So this is for November, like I said. I think there was like a thriller, I don't know, a romance and something else, I'm not positive. Um, and then like a surprise me one. And so, um, I think I picked the, or not the thriller, like the suspense or the mystery. I think there was like mystery, comedy and romance or something, I can't remember, something like that. And so they give you like a little blurb about what each book's about. And I think I got the mystery one. And then I guess, depending on what you, which one you choose, or you could choose the surprise me, I think is another option, is what kind of goes in the box to go with your book. It's supposed to be like all about the five senses. So I kind of like that because it all like goes with whatever the book's about. So, so this is what it is. Oh, uh, this is what it looks like either something spilled or may, maybe there's a candle or something in there it smells good so this is the book I guess that I chose and it's like a little it says volume 67 and I guess it has like all the stuff that's in the book or in your box and what could be or what is in your box depending on which size you got I think is, is how it goes so Ooh, I got like a little shelf here that I can put it on. So, uh, okay, so looking through this, I think you can choose, depending on what box you get, I think the medium sized box, you can choose what kind of drink you want between tea, coffee, and um, some kind of alcohol mix or something like that. Mm. So anyways, I think I got the tea, I think is what I got. Could be wrong, I can't remember, it's been like a month. Um, so it tells you all about the, oh, I thought it told you about the, the books, but it doesn't. Okay. So, so the site is the book, which is by Katie Hayes and it's, it's called the Cloisters. Cloisters. And it says when Anne Stillwell arrives in New York city, she expects to spend her summer working as a curatorial, is that right? Curatorial associate at the Metropolitan, Metropolitan Museum of Art. Instead, she finds herself finds herself assigned to the Cloisters, a Gothic museum and garden renowned for its medieval art collection and its group of enig enigmatic enigmatic researchers studying the history of divin divination divination. I don't know. Okay, so I think that's the site. I think that's it. Okay, so. Um, so it comes with this little, oh. <laughs> mm. this is the little 
author's uh, signature that you can put in the book if you so choose. Where am I going to put this? Okay, and then this is a bookmark from the book and it says, we are all obsessed with our fates for they're the only thing we cannot control, the one thing we are blind to. So that's the bookmark that you use in your book. Okay, so this is the hand poured, let me look up here. Okay, this is the hand poured soy candle and it's for the smell and it says the scent wait does it say it's about to get literary okay so the scent is nightshade which has notes of black currant and citrusy citrusy bergamot our candles are always hand stirred and poured in the authentic book studio using non-toxic toxic ingredients Oh. Smells pretty good. Okay, so that was smell. Okay, so let's see what we got. This is the tea, which would be the taste, and this is called zigzag tea. It's black currant, elderflower, and lime leaves herbal tea but there's actually sachets in here i thought maybe it was like um what's the word i lost it but there's actually sachets in here so that's nice so you don't have to use like a strainer or anything and it actually tells you like how long to steep it And you can enjoy this hot or cold. And that's all it says. So there is your taste. Uh, let's see what else is in here. Oh, oh, something's coming out. What is this? Is there something on here for this? Um, I guess this is smell. This is, it's body lotion and it's, I guess it's called Bamboo Forest. And it came, it actually fell out of this little bag. Oh, and the, oop, 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 oop. Okay, this is Book Nerd Society. Oh, it's a soy, oh, it's another soy wax candle. Oat moss and amber. That smells good. That's cute. That smells good, actually. Oh, this is a welcome gift. It's a new member welcome gift. So that this little bag right here with all this stuff. And it says, new gift, well, new, hmm. New member welcome gift. It says, enjoy your micro experience kit. Inside you will find sample sizes of different brands we carry in full size. This is Firecracker Popping Candy Bar. It is, um, let me see, it has sea salt, a dash of chipotle, and popping candy crackle and dark chocolate. Oh, they're little, I guess they're little bite-sized pieces. Totally not trying that because Rachel does not do spicy. And then this is elderberry and echinacea, uh, a tea packet. Oh, did I show you that? I think that's cute. I think there's like one, two, I don't know, three pieces in here because it says 60, 60 calories each. So I think I feel three. So that's cute. Little welcome gift. What else is in here? Uh, oh, okay. This is from Face Story, and it is the touch. It is the Dream Garden. Is it Camellia? Camellia mask. 
It says dive into a nourishing skin treatment with this oil infused sheet mask. This mask provides strengthening and protecting properties with antioxidant rich ingredients like green tea and camellia flower. So that is your touch element. Oh, here's the book. Oh wait, there's something else in here. What is this? Oh, this is also touch. And I'm kind of sad about this, but maybe it's part, there is, there might be something in the book about it. Um, but I think I would have preferred any other thing, a replacement or, you know, an exchange or something for this because I don't believe in it. I don't like it. And so I don't know what I'm going to do with this, but this is the other touch, I guess, element is the tarot cards. <sighs> yeah, that's all I'm going to say about that. And like I said, there might be something in the book about it. I just, maybe, I don't know. I missed that part, I guess. So here's the book. It's a really nice uh, sleeve. says this is supposed to be $28. Woo! Rachel would not buy this for $28. Just throwing that out there. Um, let's see. Oh, geez. Okay, well, there you go. As soon as you get in the back, there's a reading guide for the tarot cards. So there must be something in here about them that I just didn't realize. Otherwise, I wouldn't have picked this book. I wouldn't have picked it. Um, and maybe I just missed it when I was talking about the divination or d divine nation or what, whatever it is. I may, I must not have read that part or something because I never would have got this book. Bummer. Anyways, the box is so beautiful. Look at it. Um, it's got the, the floral and it's got a whole lot of these uh, squizzlies, but the box is beautiful. So I think there's a larger uh, option that you can get for this box. And then the middle size, I, I believe is what I got. And then there's a smaller option. Um, I think where you only get like, I think you get like the box. Um, I think you would have got, not the box. You would have got the book, the face mask and the candle, I believe is all that you, you would get. And then uh, with this, the next higher option, you got the tea and the cards along with the other ones. And then the next option, the, the most expensive option, you would have got a sugar scrub and some sort of black or uh, dark chocolate bar. So, and then there's also, let me see. It tells you about the zigzag tea. Oh, and it, oh, I always I forgot to say they actually have a book playlist that you can um, look on Spotify, and I guess you're supposed to kind of play that while you're reading it. And then there is a recipe for a drink that you can. try and make, I guess, that goes with the book. I don't know. Um, also, there is a food recipe for lemon lavender shortbread cookies. And it shows you how to do that as well. And, and it says 5% of your membership will be donated to the Adopt a Classroom Foundation supporting children's education and their educators. So, I, don't, I already picked my book for December. And I think I, I think I may have skipped January, if I'm not mistaken. I don't know. Uh, I think I'm gonna wait for December and see what it does, see what happens. I might just go with the smaller option, like the book, you know, and then two other things, like a candle and a face mask or something. I don't know. 
I can't remember how much how much difference it was. Like if it was a ten dollar difference or a twenty dollar difference, I can't remember. I don't remember. And then maybe a ten dollar difference if you want to go higher. I don't. I can't remember. I can't remember. So, anyways, so here's the little book that tells you all about your stuff. So for sixty dollars or sixty one something something something, you get a book that says it's supposed to be twenty eight dollars. Would never pay twenty eight dollars for a book. Just saying. Um, I got a cute little bookmark and the author's signature that you can put in here somewhere. Oh, here's a little squiggly. Um, tarot cards. Um, a face mask. Some tea. And, oh, and a candle. That's what I got for $60. The other stuff, this little, you know, sachet or this little whatever this is, of stuff was just for like new members so it's not like I'm gonna get it in every box but it's cute um but yeah for $60 I don't know I don't know I don't know about that I may just go down to the smaller I mean I wish they would still have the drink that you could choose like the drink or the candle because I really don't care about the candle just saying I wish you could choose between the candle and the drink or, you know what I mean? Like options. Like if you don't want the candle, if you can, you know, something else, but oh well. Anyways, so that is the Authentic Books experience. That's the first one I got for November. Um, I may come back and tell you about, no, I'm gonna read the book. And then maybe when I unbox December, I can tell you if I like the book or not, or if it's worth it, I don't know. So anyways, let me know what you guys think. I know I've got I've I've seen a lot of unboxings for this and that's really nice and a lot of people like it but I just I don't know for sixty dollars <laughs> not gonna lie not gonna lie sixty bucks is a lot of money so like I said I might go to the cheaper option depending on how much it is I don't know so anyways let me know what you guys think something new I do like reading um, I did get me one of those what was it a Black Friday deal. I got the Barnes and Noble Nook Glow Light or something like that for half off. Yes, I did. So I've been reading a lot since I got that guy because it's like this big and you can put it in your bag. So anyways, so that's one of my goals for next year is to read more. So we'll see how that goes. Anyways, that's what I got. So I hope you guys are having a fabulous day. Stay safe, stay well, and stay blessed and stay warm, and we'll see you on the next video. Bye, guys.